हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक एंड सॉरी आई कुड नॉट अपलोड अ न्यू वीडियो फॉर सम पीरियड बिकॉज आई वाज बिजी इन सम अदर वर्क फ्रॉम नाउ ऑन आई विल ट्राई टू अपलोड अ न्यू वीडियो एवरी लेट से संडे आई विल ट्राई टू स्टिक टू दिस शेड्यूल एज फार एज पॉसिबल सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू डू बॉटल फिलिंग प्रोसेस एनिमेशन यूजिंग माइक्रोसॉफ्ट पावर पॉइंट सो हियर वॉट आई हैवन आई हैवन टू कन्वर बेल्ट वन कन्वर बेल्ट विल बी मूविंग दीज एम टी बॉटल्स टूवर्ड्स लेफ्ट एंड दीज कन्वर बेल्ट विल बी यूज टू फील दीज बॉटल्स टूवर्ड्स वाइल दे मूविंग टूवर्ड्स राइट दिस इज द बटन टू स्टार्ट एंड स्टॉप द प्रोसेस सो फर्स्ट वी विल सी द एनिमेशन देन वी विल गो थ्रू द प्रोसेस ऑफ हाउ टू डू इट सो वेन आई क्लिक ऑन दिस बटन द प्रोसेस इज गेटिंग स्टार्टेड दिस कन्वर बेल्ट इज मूविंग टूवर्ड्स राइट दिस मूविंग टूवर्ड्स लेफ्ट सॉरी राइट this is left right sorry then uh, these bottles are getting filled up so if i click on this button again the process will get stopped and if i click on it again it will start from the beginning okay so just to make this video shorter uh, what i have done i have just copied this lower half of the uh, animation not the effect only the uh, shapes and i will not show this upper half because the process of doing this uh, animation of this upper half is uh, uh, almost same as that of this lower half so here what i have done i have um, placed these two wheels you can get it from the clip art you can just search for wheel and you can get this wheel then for making this conner belt what i have done i have go inserted a shape this shape and just copy paste it align it properly okay then you can change the color and group them together to make this conner belt so make sure the the length of this conner belt should be uh, more than the your presentation slide almost double or more than double we can say okay then we will add the effect so first we will go to animation custom animation we will add effect of spin okay so we want uh, this conner belt to move uh, towards right so we want this to be spinning in clockwise position okay then we will select this conner belt go to add effect motion path select right then select the motion path hold the shift key and adjust the size of this end point up to this then we will select this one and we will select motion path right just a second not right left again hold select the motion path hold down the shift key and adjust the length just a minute okay now uh, we want all these effects uh, to happen on click of this button so uh, again before showing this i will just show you uh, if you go to home and go to select selection pen i have renamed uh, all these shapes like uh, if i click on this button the name of this button is start stop if i click on this conveyor belt the name of this conveyor belt is upper conveyor belt for bottle likewise this is upper conveyor belt this is lower conveyor belt just in the to make it uh, easier for you to understand uh, to which shape you are applying the animation okay so if i double click on this effect i need to go to timing then we will repeat it until next click then click on trigger and click on start effect on click of that button that name of that button is start stop okay now we will select all these effect and move it here okay 
then except for this one we will select with previous I think we can do this also with previous let's see okay I think if we select one click let's see what happens okay for this one I have not selected until next click and we need to remove this smooth start smooth end okay here also until next click okay let's see now okay now the speed of this color belt and these wheels is seems to be not matching so let's see what is what we have selected uh, this one is medium so we will select this one as slow 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 let's see if it is matching or else we can increase the sp speed of this spin animation and let's see okay so this seems uh, somewhat matching now we will need to apply the same effect to this also so we'll go to motion path select right select uh, motion path hold down the shift key adjust the length again double click on it remove smooth start smooth end repeat until next click trigger on click of start and stop okay now uh, also we don't want uh, let's say if I am here and I click on this slide anywhere my slide is not getting ahead so what I have done in animation I have removed this on mouse click if it is clicked then what happens if I click anywhere my slide will move forward so I don't want it to happen so this needs to be unchecked now also when I click on this button my animation just a minute this one I need to make it with previous and speed slow okay now when I click on this button my animation is starting but it is not getting stopped see so what we need to do we just need to insert another shape whatever you want okay double click on it make its outline no outline then make its shape as white so that it is getting blended with our background and you don't see any shape here okay then click on the uh, shape go to add effect go to exit disappear double click on the effect go to timing and select trigger and we will select trigger at same start and stop okay so now you can see if I click on this button my animation is getting started and if I click on this button again the animation should get stopped see and if I click on it again it will get started okay now we need to show these uh, bottles so what you can do you just go to insert clip parts and you can just type here empty bottle and I have selected this bottle okay you can just uh, resize it now you also need to show the filling liquid so for that what we need to do just zoom in go to insert shapes 
then hmm, free form okay so what you need to do you just follow these outlines so i am not drawing it uh, properly because i have already made this made this uh, so i am just making it to understand for your understanding you can just follow these lines properly and close here and you can just recolor it with whatever color you want change its outline also to the same color okay then we can add any effect we want like say we want uh, wipe from bottom like this one so that we, uh, it seems like our bottle are getting filled up then we can just group them not group them just select all the shapes and resize it okay okay so this is not done properly so i have just made it for your understanding purpose i have already prepared it here just a minute i'll zoom out here so here what i have done i have just uh, attached one nozzle nozzle is nothing but one can select a line or a rectangle and make it a 3d option then change its color whatever color you want okay like this i have made this and i have grouped it together with bottle and not the filling effect okay so these are grouped together so i'll just make control z now what we will do now we will select all these two shapes control c control v bring it over here then go to add effect motion path select right okay now select both the motion path adjust it somewhere over here now by holding down the shift key increase the length of the motion path same for this lower one okay so one motion path is for you can see here it is group to it it is nothing but a bottle and a nozzle those are grouped together this motion path is for free form 291 that is this filled up portion okay so again uh, what uh, we will do we will make it with previous select both these free forms and bring it down okay so let's see what is happening if i click on this bottle is getting here now i need to make it remove this smooth start smooth end go to timing and make it repeat until next click you will select timing at let's say slow let's see okay so now our bottles are moving continuously here so along with the bottle we need to show this bottle getting filled up so we will select that free form go to add effect entrance select wipe okay. select slow from 
bottom with previous and adjust it over here let's see okay now what we will do we will just copy this again control c control v so all our effects are getting copied and just adjust it over the existing one now all the effect shall remain same on the only thing that will change is timing we need to introduce timing delay of 0.5 second on each effect okay then select these effects and move them below so that they are happening on click of start and stop button let's see just a minute Until next click. This is not made until next click. Let's see here also. Until next click. Let's see. Oh, this delay is not saved uh, since we have moved this effect to here this delay got deleted so we just need to add this delay again 0.5 seconds 0.5 seconds now see okay now we just need to repeat this process for showing more bottles so what I will do I will uh, go to select selection pane this is free from 295 or else We'll copy this one only. Control C, Control V. Keep it somewhere over here and add the effects. When adjust it on the previous motion path. should be overlapped exactly then add wipe effect okay from bottom we'll select slow 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 then select all these effect shift them below Remove smooth start, smooth end, timing, 
slow repeat until next click make it with previous also we need to add delay here also so last effect we had a delay of 0.5 so here we will make it 1 you need to increase it by 0.5 second select this paste it move it over here and just select this and overlap it on the existing motion path again select all the effects move them anywhere you want preferably I will make it here then adjust the delay increase it by 0.5 seconds okay now I will just delete this now uh, we don't want our bottles to be shown let's say here I start these are appearing from here okay so I think we can add another bottle if you want but I am not adding because the length of the video will get increased so we don't want to show these uh, bottles are getting disappeared here and appearing here so what we can do we can just add some cover like this one okay also this conveyor belts you can see when I start you can see these uh, belts are getting displayed here so if you don't want it to get displayed you can again use the free form and add some white colored shape like this one and put it over here we can just add uh, any white color shape and just make this wheel just a minute make it in front make this one in front ok so likewise again copy it over here make your wheel to front this cover to front now if you can see hmm, our uh, conveyor belt is covered here and bottles are also covered here if I click on this button bottles are getting filled up click on this it will get stopped so if you want I will just add it's a matter of just 2 minutes C control V adjust it over here select the motion path just don't select this one because here uh, two shapes are overlapped so I will select this one and 
adjust it over here okay bring this effect down seconds okay now let's see now this is getting filled up if you want you can just again uh, add one bottle so this empty space will not be shown you will get a continuous bottles moving here guess I need to add a delay of let's say 2.5 seconds for the next bottle so this is how you can make this uh, bottle filling process animation using Microsoft PowerPoint 2007. The process of making the upper half of the convertibility is uh, almost same uh, as followed for this one. So thank you guys for watching my uh, videos and if you like my videos uh, do subscribe to my channel and don't forget to leave a comment for any suggestions that you want me to implement in my future videos. Thank you guys.